Hello, I'm Dave Cravassier, and happening today on your 13 Action News Update, hospital workers are planning to walk out again, even as coronavirus cases are climbing in Clark County. Workers at Mountain View Hospital say the hospital is threatening to increase their health care costs, take away benefits, and they're refusing a request for hazard pay. The walkout takes place at 6.30 this morning, and there will be another walkout at 3.30 p.m. The Nevada Hospital Association is reporting a 230% increase in COVID-19 patients over the past month. Due to the high COVID-19 positivity rate and rising cases, UMC has made the decision to temporarily limit adult surgical procedures to emergencies for the next week. The NHA says unlike earlier increases, hospitals across the state confirm they have enough PPE and access to COVID-19 testing has improved. Clark County has hit a major milestone in its COVID-19 testing efforts. The county has given out more than 400,000 free tests since May. Officials say testing is an important tool to help slow the spread. You can get a free COVID-19 test today and tomorrow at Centennial High School. The test will be conducted in the school's gym from 8 a.m. till noon or until supplies last. No appointment needed. Right, midweek, we're looking at above average temperatures and some extra cloud cover for the valley. Today, you'll see those high clouds starting to build in towards the afternoon, starting out in the mid 40s. These temps pretty mild for this time of year, but breezy conditions are going to be ushered in by a dry cold front Thursday and Friday. That usher also ushers in some cooler conditions. So we'll be tumbling right back down to the upper 50s Friday and mid 50s for the weekend. More sunshine expected as we get towards Saturday and Sunday, and we will see those overnights dropping from the 40s and back into the mid 30s. Those seasonally cool conditions are expected to last through at least Tuesday and we're staying dry. No rain on the horizon. Thanks, Kelsey, and that was your 13 Action News update. You can find more on our website, ktnv.com, and our free mobile app.